Hello and welcome to HD Calcs. As always, I'm Rick, and today we're going to have a look at how we can solve roots or radicals on the Sharp EL738F financial calculator. To do this, we'll use the second function key. It looks like this, located here in the top left corner. The three key with the second function of square root. It looks like this, located here. And the bond key with the second function of root, x root. Looks like this, located here. It's got that green B on it. So for starters, if we just want to square root a number, like for example, find the square root of 25, we start by pressing the second function key and then the 3 because that was our square root, remember? And then we enter in our number after the square root sign. So 25, there we go, press equals. We see at the top of the screen the square root of 25 equals 5. How about roots that aren't square roots? Well, to do that, we start by entering the root. So if we're doing, say, the third root of 1,000, we start with the 3, and then the second function, and then the bond key here. There you'll see an x root there. x is the 3 in this case. And then we enter the number we're finding the root for here. So in our case, that's 1,000. And press equals. And we see third root of 1,000 is equal to 10. Another example, let's find the fifth root of 32. Again, first we enter the root, so that's 5. And then second bond, there we go, x root. And we're finding 32, so 32 equals. And we see we get the fifth root of 32 is equal to 2. All right, I hope this helps, and good luck on those tests out there, everybody.